the defining moment for Soviet partisans was, without a doubt, the Vitsyevsk Gate. This hole in the Eastern Front Line, basically a Soviet-controlled corridor, became the central hub for partisan activities and traffic. Seeing its potential, Soviet strategists started supporting the partisan units on a very different level. The Red Army organized centralized administrative and logistical support, and the gate became a big factor in supporting partisan troops in German-held territory with weapons. This enabled the partisan units to become a big factor, inflicting very heavy damage to the German supply chain. German terror campaigns that followed took a terrible toll. In the end, this drove civilians out of their homes and villages, and into the camps of the partisans. In this mission, you'll be given the chance to prove yourself as a partisan. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video, Get to Hell. In this video, we're covering the fourth mission in the Soviet campaign, Unbroken where we take command of some partisans. So as you can see, they're all set up in the trees and there is a German convoy on its way to a village. Upon arrival to the village, I want the prisoners dealt with and the men gathered for a sweep of the marshes. The command wants us to rat out a problematic partisan. And just like that, the first armored car has just been hit. And so is the truck with our POWs in it. Besides that I lost control of the steering, the brakes are also down, God damn it. So it's gonna roll down the hill. Uh, and eventually stop, whatever. Just like that, the drivers have been killed. There's a guy in the back, he's gonna try and get away, and he's also killed, so. Go comrades, take cover and grab any weapon you find after the fastest invaders. They're all gonna run around, hopefully uh, hide. And hopefully we can get to take control of these guys. Now I suppose, okay, so we can take control. I'm just gonna grab this guy. Go grab a rifle and assist the partisans. We get a rifle from this guy as well. Uh, can we get any more rifles? The drivers should have rifles. So, try and get uh, some weapons from these guys. I get this guy a rifle as well. So, I'm gonna get a rifle for this guy. Perfect. <coughs> So I think we can now start fighting back. So we take control of this guy. And uh, there's a guy underneath the truck there. Oh, that was a headshot. Right to the face. Dome that guy. There's a dude in that truck. People wagon, sorry. And I just need to reload real quick. Hopefully. Hopefully I can shoot this guy. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Right, so get up to this truck, get some cover. I don't know where he is, I can't see him. There he is. Got him, got him, got him. Hopefully I can get this guy wherever he went. He's on the ground, got him as well. Got that guy. I'm stuck, I can't do nothing, can't move. He's gonna try and get away as well. Oh, he's dead. Oh, there's another guy there. Got him. Oh, they're running away now. Yeah, running away. Would you believe it? They're actually running away from the battlefield. Guess they don't want to die. Don't know where they're going to go, like. There's not... Nowhere really to go. But anyway, we're going to get these guys up here. I'm gonna chase after th these guys with this this uh, guy since he's a lone 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 ranger. We killed nine guys already. So if we can get here and get these uh, guys dealt with. Oh, never mind. What's happening? Oh, looks like all these guys are gonna have a nice little meet up, have a cup of tea and maybe a scone or something like that, or scone, as I like to say in uh, London, scone. So these guys are all gonna have a chat. Welcome to Opsich, comrades. I'm in charge here. The fascists are sending a lot of their convoys through these roads nowadays. We try to target the easy ones with supplies. 
We could use your help. The Germans are doing something to our village. It has become a fortified supply nexus. They've reinforced the sector and we know nothing of our people. We fear the worst. We'll join you, comrade. First, we need to get the hell out of here before the Germans know what hit them. Of course we did. Agreed. Follow us. We'll take you to our hideout. So, I'm actually just going to grab the machine gun off this Kuba wagon. Hopefully we can get... Oh, we're being shot at. I think if we grab this, we can go take care of these guys now. Because they're going to be a bit of an annoying issue try and get away from us but we're gonna do one better don't lay on, don't lay on the ground got him he's... okay so they're dealt with cool um there is a truck with ammo and crates in the back of this so i'm thinking maybe there's weapons in here and what a good guess there is weapons so i'm gonna grab this guy I'm gonna swap his weapon out for the sniper. Hopefully, I can get this guy some. Give him the automatic one. And give this guy the rifle. Okay. So, we got all our guys kitted out with weapons and stuff. I think it's time we go to the uh, partisan dugout or hideout, whatever. So we get there. I'm gonna speed it up a bit. So I had to lower the settings on this uh, for this mission because the fog effect was just making it stutter. As you can see, there is a tiny bit of stutter whenever rotating camera, but um, able to play it now. So the quality had to be dimmed just to make it playable. Uh, also, if I did play this mission before. It it's very hard. Oh very hard and there's discord ruining my life as always so I'm uh, gonna turn that off real quick <laughs> so we got here gonna uh, just turn the game speed to normal follow the partisans to their dugout the German activity in the village is alarmingly high there is a reckless German officer stationed there and the Soviet high command has requested we terminate him all entrances are guarded this fascist swine is important. With your men, we will attempt to infiltrate the village, take out the armor, and most importantly, do not let the fascist officer escape alive. If we can strike a hard blow against the Hitlerite hordes, hopefully they will leave our village alone. What? Impossible! Somebody has given away our hideout! Oh, he's gonna turn I the gun on us now. I should have never trusted you, traitors! Ooh, how could we be traitors if we were in POWs? Stop this nonsense, comrade, we've not betrayed you. Of course we haven't. Comrade, commander, I don't think they have given our position away, it's just... It's not just the Germans, some of our villagers have joined them too. The fascists are forcing our pe own people against us. Sweet. Not sweet. Oh, dude, they shot him. Why? That's a war. Oh, that's a war crime, man. So we got some partisans running towards us. I guess those are German partisans, since it's villagers. And a half track full of Germans as well. So, bonus, I guess. Hopefully we can get a uh, hold of this half track and use it against them. Might be able to decrew it maybe. So we're gonna get uh take defensive positions, we will defend this place to the last man. Ooh, okay. Hopefully there is a radio in one of these uh buildings to There's ammo, weapons and equipment in the crates. Take what you need to get our guys some uh, reinforcements and artillery support where are we gonna set up there's a log back here so we're gonna get set up there hopefully hold this open area right, need to suss out where the Germans are right now okay there are half tracks coming along uh, there is partisans 
coming along as well. Small little patrol. Great, just what we need. So we're in position to hopefully take out this half track, maybe? So we're gonna wait for him to arrive. Whenever that is, don't know when. Yeah, so these missions are quite long actually, and I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to sit through them, so I'm gonna try and get this recorded in one session, so so uh, hopefully it all works out. There's some Germans, man. Oh, he's coming towards us. Hopefully, get these guys. Get them from behind before the MG42 kills us all. Uh, oh, there's a guy just waiting for us. Get him. Got him. Uh, this guy here. Whoa, let's swap them. What's what's he doing? Alright, hopefully we can get this guy. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. This guy here is just standing up in the open. Got him. So I feel that we are in the position to move a little bit forward, so if we get here we can get a good shot on these guys now. Pretty much wiped out most of them. So we're gonna get here and uh, be able to just open fire on these guys. Whenever that is. Oh, he's got his hand in the air. He's down. And there's another guy around here somewhere. Where is he? Oh, the ground swallowed him. What? He got swallowed by the ground. Okay, now we're in the position to get in this hat track. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's get in this hat track. So all the partisans, German partisans are over there. So we're just going to pile into this hat track now. And use it against them. Oh, they got some sound effects whenever they're going in. Cool. Alright. Let's drive this thing to... Turn it around! Come on. Swamp is bogging down the track, so... We're not doing too well. Oh, we're being shot at now. Where are they? I don't see them. Oh, they're there. Got rid of him. To him. This MG is pretty powerful, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, he's still alive. There's another guy? Where is he? Oh, there he is. He's dead. So, just the issue now is reversing. <laughs> if we can get it reversed, come on. This is the only problem about the marshes is everything gets stuck and bogged down. So it makes turning and driving difficult. And then if you get stuck, that is you completely screwed. Also guys, I uh, found a new game. It's an FPS called Fallen Angel. I think it's in an early access. I'm gonna do some videos on that. It seems really cool. I um, was playing a bit of it today and it has like space, uh, space combat, you can board ships and stuff, and battle on the stations, and you can also fly, uh, or command capital ships, so it's really cool, definitely worth uh, checking out, and also me and Commander Lies is going to return to doing the Men of War Sir Hinkle missions soon, at some point, uh, right now, just a little bit busy, so... Hope to get the next mission we're gonna try out, which is the German mission or Italian mission. Apparently, it's supposed to be one of the harder, harder missions. So that'll be a good little mini series to do. Just on that one mission. Get rid of all these guys now. Just, I think we've just obliterated a whole German company platoon. I'm not sure what how many men makes the company. I'm pretty. Well, I think it's eight men make a platoon or something like that. So, and then twelve men make a, a company, or is it a battalion? 
I actually can't remember. It's been that long since I've looked into this sort of thing. Um, but if you guys have uh, knowledge on that, do let me know in the comments. So we're driving really slow because our front wheels have been buggered. So we're going to try and get over to this. There's like another set of... Uh... Oh, they got mortars set up. Holy crap. So we're gonna slowly just drive over here. Slowly. I think I think it's because the wheels are damaged, so I'm thinking of repaired those first. Using shift R to get these repaired. I think if we speed this up a tiny bit. What are you doing? Cool. So I think we can go a little bit faster now. Alright, come on, bud. Okay, that's us. We're on. Oops, better turn down the speed. Load our MG. We got 250 rounds. Uh... Oh, dude. Oh, flip. Gotta get moving. Oh, boys. What's happening? What? What the hell? What the hell's happening? What the? What is going on right now? What the hell is happening? Run! Run! Run for your life! Um, so the half track's broken right now. Don't know what's happening. Defend the camp. We're only Great one guy comrades. strong right now. now we lost all our comrades. Behind. We must proceed with our plans of liberating Opsich and terminating the fascist commanding officer. Um, half track's completely broken, boys. I believe the driver's dead, so he's just got his butt. Okay, never I mind. I your squad to move swiftly. Some of my men are acting as spotters in the village. Cut off any escape routes the officer may want to use. We will attack when you give us the signal. Okay, so... If the officer is compromised, he will try to escape. You must have all exits covered by the time you give us the attack signal. I'll give you three of my best men to help you in this dangerous task. Right, so we got back to this truck and uh, we just happened to find the radio and we called uh, command for some reinforcements and they're sending us some troops. So, sent us some troops. <laughs> totally not cheating, boys. Totally not cheating. Um, they sent us some troops. They've also sent us some tanks as well. So they sent us some T-34s. Yeah, sent us some T-34 boys. So we got those that are uh, in our arsenal now. Cool boys, got these to play with now. Sweet. Okay, that half drag's just spinning around on its own still. We've also sent uh, uh, some artillery support as well, so artillery is helping us. Artillery, help them. 
Oh. Got got the uh, artillery helping us. So managed to kill the officer with the artillery. I'm gonna start storming the the village now. So we got these guys helping us now. And I think we're gonna call in some more artillery. <laughs> this is totally not uh, cheat right now. Managed, managed to get. Oh, their artillery is so accurate. Whoa, look at that. Oh, my goodness. Go boys. Pure steam rolling right now. Turn, 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 turn. Can we get some more guys inside this uh, tank. I think we're doing pretty well right now. The attack signal. Go for the motherland. Death to the fascist beast. Okay, so that half track is still just turning in circles. I think if we leave it, it'll sort itself out. Don't know what's happening over here. But we're doing pretty well. Some more artillery barrage. Do it pretty well, boys. Our village may remain free from the yoke of fascism. Do it pretty well. So we got some artillery. Yes. Home, sweet home. They left behind all the documents. How very interesting. What is it? Convoys. Lots of them. It seems we're in one of the few available crossroads where they don't get completely stuck in the mud. Every truck we stop, every minute we delay them, it buys precious time for our comrades in the front line to stop the fascist advance. Eliminate the enemy convoys. Don't let any supply vehicles get past. Okay. Sweet. So I'm thinking they're all just gonna come from this direction. So we get set up here with the tanks. And get this guy over here. Take down the trucks. They are our target. Let the armored So we're gonna move. get some uh, no artillery support. Completely got rid of them. That's the enemy supply trucks dealt with. So hopefully we can hold this line. I 
<laughs> totally not cheating, boys. Just gotta s speed things up. Hopefully we can get all our men into the village. This thing's still going around in circles. It's all right, boys. We'll hold the defensive positions. Can't believe we got all this done. Man, the Germans were cruel. They just slaughtered some of our guys. Put them up against posts and shot them. Cruel, man. Oh, we got some guys over here. Can we get some more guys over there? Another column is coming soon. I'll keep you posted. All right. I reckon you have a couple of minutes until its arrival. Find some mines or explosives around the village and prepare for them. Sweet. Okay. Got four minutes to wait. All right, let's get our tanks into the place. Speed on these things. Also, guys, uh, this is a little inkling into uh, messing around with the editor. <laughs> uh, I have been working on a. Oh, ah, what's this? We could work on that. Cool, we just find the uh, secret objective, which is an AT cannon. So, we're going to get some of these guys on here. So, get them on. And get our. AT gun up and going. Get him over here. Waiting on the next convoy. So we gotta take out 10 supply trucks. I think if we just set up here, we'll have a good chance of getting most of the supply trucks. So, gonna move all this stuff out of the way. Bulldoze it. Whoa, okay. Wow, that was a bit weird. Alright, I'm gonna get up here. Okay, next 25 seconds, there's gonna be some guys inbound from where? Oh, okay. Oh, they're coming this way, alright. That's right. Let's fix that. Gonna get these guys. Is the number supply truck gone? Is the number supply truck? I thought I turned off this word. How do we completely turn this word off? Sweet! Oh, there's still some guys here. Oh, Got him. Don't know where they're gonna come from. So we're just going to have to wait and find out. Like Speedy Gonzales right now. Shweel. So yeah, I'm not really taking this uh, mission pretty serious because it's a stealth mission. And to be honest, it's, I don't really like, as I said in the previous stealth mission, I don't really like playing them. Um, just really boring and 
I have played this mission before, it took nearly an hour, and I attempted it so many times that I literally just gave up on it, so I'm just playing around with the editor. Um, until I get the uh, get to hell editor video out. It's gonna be a wave defense, so there's gonna be Germans in a winter set in setting where they're gonna defend against waves upon waves upon waves of Russians. And it's basically fight to the last man, see how long we can hold out sort of sorta of deal. And then we're gonna do a wee bit of a tug of war in Stalingrad or Moscow or something like that. Gonna wait for this German convoy to arrive. Do some donuts, boys. Yeah! Doing some donuts. Skirt, skirt, skirt. Okay. okay. 50 seconds to wait. Oh, they're coming from the same direction as they came the last time. That's okay. We, we got this. So, I'm just going to get set up here. And here they come. Alright, it seems like to be armored cars and stuff like that, so I think we would just sink some rounds in inside of them. Okay, turn the vehicle. And then we can just sink some round rounds into these guys. That is. Whoa. I like the I like the sounds of the internal sounds. Right there. Oh, we just need to take out one more truck, boys. I think that's it, really. Um, Artillery happening. Dang, man. That was pretty brutal, if I have to say so myself. We're gonna get out, repair the tank. Oh, there's mines out here? My scouts can see the next German convoy has almost arrived on our doorstep. I will keep you posted. Whoops. Uh oh. Yeah, boys. Get rid of all the mines right now. <laughs> this is dope. Yeah, so um, I haven't really done any missions on Gates of Hell for quite some time. Um, just mainly because I've been focusing on getting the Half Life maps remastered. Um, I've been doing live streams, but I think I, don't, I think I'm going to hold off doing live streams for quite some time. It's just as of right now, the whole issue with the pixelation CPU usage and computer dying slowly is just making it for basically I can't really provide a good enjoyable live stream um, or high quality as videos so I'm thinking of holding off those for a while um, I would have really liked to have done 
the uh, live stream on case of hell, but I don't think that's gonna be happening at any point. Okay. I think if we get these tanks set up, get them over here real quick. Why are we stuck? We're stuck! So, all we gotta do is take out one supply truck and then that is us done. And that's it. Okay, so Vitebisk Gate would play an important part in the war. It enab enabled the partisans to disrupt supply lines more easily. Big battles were influenced by the partisans, such as the Battle of Kursk. German supplies would never be safe again, and many partisans re enlisted in the Red Army once their ter territory had been liberated. A fate which. Fate. fate uh, to which they themselves had been instrumental. Okay guys, so that pretty much wraps up this uh, video. It was pretty fun to play with the editor uh, settings in an actual mission. Um, hopefully this will be the last time we actually do this because it's kind of cheating. So anyway, it was a great video. Hope you guys liked it and I will catch you all in the next one. So peace out.